Hey guys, hope you're well and welcome to this commission completion video. We have an awesome Elder commission for you guys to have a look at today with one of the Phoenix Lords himself from Album Ra, uh, but really, really cool project. Uh, if you're new to Siege Studios YouTube channel, then Siege as a business is a premium UK-based commission miniature painting service with 28 painters who all paint from an above tabletop level all the way up to competition entry quality. Now, if you are interested in a commission with us, then very simply, all you need to do is head to the website with link in the description of this video, which takes you to our contact form. On that contact form, select the relevant drop down options for your project from those available. And in the message section, send us a list of models in our message format, which is uh, stated on there as well. And uh, you can obviously fire that off to us to get the process started. Now we're back in a second to have a look at this awesome project in more detail. Stick around, we've got some great miniatures coming up next. So let's dive in, have a look at this really cool Elder Commission we've had the pleasure of working on for one of our clients. Uh, some really cool aspects, obviously you've got the Dark Reapers and then we have the Phoenix Sword himself, Margaret Ra. Really, really cool character and a very sort of defiant pose. Our client has requested a, a fallen enemy on his base as well and we'll have a look at that in a bit more detail now. Uh, so Margaret Ra, really cool model, he's lasted the test of time, awesome, awesome amounts of detail on him. We've got a lovely trophy of a dead ultramarine there on the base for as our client requested. <laughs> All the gems and little lenses everything all fully picked out in his faceplate and also on the gun as well uh, and even on the uh, dead ultramarine with some lovely blood effects there just to show his vitae and vital fluids draining from him and uh, you've got these lovely aspects of detail on all the black armor here with the very menacing bone work as well plus obviously on the end of this scythe part of the weapon a little bit of chipping and detail work done damage on that sort of metal part there as well which is really cool uh, keith is the artist who's worked on this awesome project Loads of really, really cool bits and bobs that he's done throughout the project, the little complimentary blue gems and all those aspects of detail, which are really, really nice. Uh, so that's just Malgam Ra, really cool Phoenix Lord. Uh, and then we have the two squads of Dark Reapers. Uh, no other better units to accompany Malgam Ra, but as you can see here, you've got one of the Exarchs here. Really, really cool model. Again, very stoic. He's firing the shots off there, as you can see. Um, now, these are the fine cast versions of the models. They aren't the metal ones. Um, so, obviously, you can see that the fine cast models themselves have got brilliant sort of sculpting on them as well, which is really lovely. Uh, Keith's done some lovely work adding little bits of like uh, elder glyphs and things onto the weapons as well, for example, on this guy, as you can see there. But all the lenses and everything fully picked out and highlighted there as well, which is really nice. So, that's just the uh, exile from that squad. And pull forward a couple of the Dark Reapers themselves so you can see those. Again, all the lenses and gems and everything fully picked out and highlighted there moving around so you can see the reverse of the model as well and uh, really really cool stoic pose there on this dude uh, pull forward a couple from the back as well so you can see these again really really cool models uh, very sinister and menacing and insidious with that sort of black obsidian armor there as well which is really nice so that's just him we'll pull forward the exarch from the other squad just so you can see the consistency from unit to unit here again you've got that lovely little elder symbol there just on the weapon and moving around again that sort of very stoic pose with his foot raised there as you can see firing away so that's just him uh, and we'll pull forward a couple from this squad just so you can have a look at these. And this is a great example of a bronze level job so on the uh, on the uh, sort of on the Dark Reapers and Malgam Ra's painted to our silver level character minimum standard. So that's just these. Uh, again, really, really cool. All the little lenses and you've got the, the elder symbols on the heads as well and all of these as well, which is really nice. Uh, pull forward another one from the rear just so you can see him as well in all these details. Just get that to focus for you guys. Again, really, really cool models. And uh, it's, it always expect when I pick them up, I feel like they're going to be metal, but they're not, <laughs> uh, which is really cool. So that's just another one of the Dark Reapers uh, from the second squad. Uh, so overall, really cool project. I know Keith had a great time working on them. And uh, if you are sort of interested in commissioning, stick around. The last part of this video will explain how about that. And you get to see these guys again for a little bit longer. So stick around. We're back in a second so you can have a look at those. Thanks for checking the video out, guys. Really hope you've liked this lovely Elder commission that Keith's worked on. I know he had a stellar time working on all the characters and also on the Dark Reapers as well. And uh, if you are interested in an army or character quote with us here at Siege, then all you need to do very simply is head to the description of this video where the link to our contact form is. Click on that link. It'll take you directly to contact form on the Siege Studios website. Select the drop down options that are relevant for you for your project. And in the message section, include a list of models in our format, which is listed on there. Fire that off. And we'll come back to you and get the process started. Uh, so also while you're here in the description of the video, you can find all the links to our social media. So Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, go give us a like and follow respectively on those just so you can keep up to date with everything that we're doing on there. And finally, while you're here on YouTube, do us a huge favor, 
give us a thumbs up on the video. If you collect Eldar, let us know the reasons why. What's your favorite character in the comments? We'd love to know. And finally, hit the bell icon when you do subscribe to keep up to date and be notified when we put new videos up. So thanks ever so much for watching the video, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye. I want to make sure that you guys have an accessible way to get hold of skills and new techniques and develop yourselves as painters. And that's it really guys, so thank you very much and we hope you'll, uh, you'll join us on Patreon.